Welcome back to Coors Field here in Denver. This one pretty much all over, but the shouting as we check our game summary to see how we've gotten to where we are. So here's the cleanup hitter, Cody Bellinger, and he'll get us started in what's officially the back third of this one. First pitch coming, here it is. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. The center fielder, number 11, A.J. Pollock. At the plate, A.J. Pollock. A hit in two at-bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Pitch on the way. Nope. Good slider there, but laid off and called the ball low. Man, this guy has retired a whole slew right now. I think what he needs to do is just stay focused and keep attacking the game plan like he has up to this point because everything he's done has worked. There's a good breaking ball as it gets the bottom of the zone. The 1-1 one, one home. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. I'll tell you, we're in the later stages of this ball game, but his fastball is still coming out of his hand with plenty on it. No runs, three hits. No errors for the Dodgers thus far. Grounded to first. Murphy's got it. And a step on first for the out. Three unassisted. The batter, number five. Shortstop, Corey Seager. Corey Seager. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Here's the first pitch to him. Yeah. And that's cut on and missed 0 and 1. Textbook pitching performance so far in this one as we move into the later innings. First pitch strikes. How about over 90%? That's about as good as it gets. This now is hit the second. Does he have another one, two, three inning? You bet he does. Eleven in a row set down, and the inning is over. This one pretty well in the bag. Stretch time coming up here in Denver. Colorado's out in front, nine to nothing. Kenta Maeda comes on the pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Number 18, Kenta Maeda. Digging in, Kyle Freeland. He's been great on the mound, so we'll see if he can do something with the bat here as well. He's earned the chance to take this at bat. Yeah, Matt, when a guy's throwing the ball as well as he has, it kind of forces the manager's hand to stay with him. He's been exciting to watch, and he's really had this crowd behind him the entire game. Line to the right side, but a foul ball. The wind up and the 0 1. Hit down the line at first. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. On, he pops it up. Muncie over to his right, makes the play, one away. The right fielder. So the Rockies lineup turns over and to the plate, Charlie Blackman. It was a solo shot for him in his last at bat. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And there's a base hit on the line. Damn, with that single, he's now three quarters of the way to hit him for the cycle. Toughest one still on the shelf, though. He's got to get it triple. Yeah, that you said it, Dero. That's one of those that's either got to hit right down the line or one of those tweeners in the gap. He has enough speed, so if he can find a gap or find one down the line, maybe he can do it, and he's going to at least get one more at bat in this one. In now, Trevor Story. He grounds it sharply to third. One there. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side. 
And the next up will be Alex Verdugo. He leads off he their half the of the eighth, and they've been the unable right to get that starter Alex out of the game to this point. Verdugo. Yeah, he settled in early on the mound, partly due to the lead his guys gave him to take some of the pressure off. He's taken that and pitched very effectively in this one. There to make the catch is Arenado for the first down. The batter. Well, these fans have been traded to a fine outing out of their hometown starter as we give you a look at the numbers here. A big zero in the run column on the right hand side of your screen. Ready once again number 16 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. Straight up. But this will land untouched. Nope. Lays off that time and it's one and two. Well, this is an approach we've seen him use effectively lately. Set up the inside and then get him out with pitches Zero. away. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11 in the ball game. Rockies on top here at Coors Field as you get a look at our line score through the first seven innings. Maeda. Kike Hernandez will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 14, Kike Hernandez. Back at him, and it hit him. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. The left now at the play, Chris Taylor has struggled at the top of the lineup in this one, hitless to this point. They set the target in, and this finds the inside corner for strike one. Ready with the 0 2. And he fouls this one off. Another 0 and 2 coming. And another foul ball. When you have two strikes on you, as a hitter, if you get something that you can handle, you have to find a way to do some damage with it. Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. Dodgers leave one. They're looking up at a 9 nothing deficit. Enters now in a mop up now, roll as he'll try to Dodgers. keep the deficit right where it Number is. 56. Adam Striding in, Calera. David Dahl, 0 for 3 with an RBI in this one. He's ready. Here's the first offering. This is line to left and a base hit, so early trouble to lead off the inning. And that's hitting one on one right there guys the only way you're able to execute now that bad. type of base hit base on that hit. type of pitch no is to recognize it early All stay right, tall no. stay back and trust the process. Here's Nolan Arenado a swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Good So a two-run shot to left center, his second home run of the game, as they just continue to pour it on here. That wasn't a particularly deep home run by today's standards, but it certainly did scream out of the park in a hurry. You see they're on show track, an impressive 112 miles an hour off the bat. Standing in now, Daniel Murphy. Daniel. Liner Murphy. towards second. Lands in for a base hit, and he's three for five in this one. Loud noises right here, fellas. Hey, he's going to have to mix it up a little bit more because they are on his second stuff. Baseman, Ryan McMahon.
stepping in now, Ryan McMahon. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. With this one almost in books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Matty V, I don't know what your thoughts are, D-Roll, but boy, when the weather starts to warm up and the ball starts jumping out like this, it's clear that the pitchers need to start making better pitches. Yeah, just great approach. No one really... Hit high in the air. There it goes. See ya! A two-run blast to straightaway right field as this lead got even wider. So batting practice continues here today as they notch their seventh home run of the game. Yeah, Matty V. Hey, d Wait, this is what Coors right. right. Field is all about, right? You come here now, to see runs, and that's what you saw today. I just like Number this lineup. 63. They didn't worry. They were going to hit homers regardless, but there's so much green grass out here playing in Denver. You stay on the approach that you're going to stay in the big part of the field. Next thing you know, you're back spinning stuff out of the yard. Yimmy Garcia comes on the pitch now, better hoping for better there. results than yeah. the other arms that they've run out there yeah. on this one. Into the box, Ian Desmond. Pollock has a read on it. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Now batting, number, number 58. 58. He's doubled and singled in four at-bats in this contest. First pitch on its way. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. Now the Dodgers get a right-hander up and throwing in their bullpen. fly ball out to straightaway center. Pollock giving chase. He gets there and that's the second out. The pitcher, number 21. So striding Kyle. forward now, Kyle Freeland. Freeland. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Verdugo is there and he puts it away to stop the. So digging in now, Max Muncy will be charged with trying to get on board, leading off the ninth. Off we go in the ninth as the first pitch misses for ball one. And even though he's had some success against this guy in the ball game, he still knows he's a very dangerous opponent. He won't want to fall behind him any further. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. The one two is swung on and missed. He got him. Up next for the Dodgers, the third baseman, Justin Turner. So stepping in, Justin Turner. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, but it was a good change up, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. Nope. Awfully close with the slider there, but it's one and one. Well, that's a great take there right there on that slider down and in. That's one of the toughest pitches to lay off of as a hitter. That hard breaking ball coming down and in at the back foot. A tough take on a good pitch. The one two. Gets him looking at the knees for the strikeout. He's really racked up the strikeouts in this one. And this guy's been the victimized three Number times 35. already today. Cody he and this lineup Bellinger. are clearly having a really tough time picking him up. And 
next will be the Dodgers cleanup hitter Cody Bellinger. He's their last shot here with two away in the ninth as they look to avoid the shutout. Yeah Matt they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching so far in this one. First pitch of the at bat. And a called strike down in the zone, nothing in one. To me, getting ahead 0 1, it's the most important pitch in the game, Matty. It puts the hitter on the defensive. I can only think of myself being in the batter's box. When I'm sitting 1 0, I am all over the gas, or I am allowed the opportunity to sit on something without fearing going 1 1. When you're down 0 1, your head's on a swivel. Now, what's left of this crowd this afternoon gets to their feet. Pulled toward right center field. Desmond is in pursuit. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Wow, not only are complete games rare in this day and age of Major League Baseball, but a complete game shutout. This guy was in total command from the first inning through the ninth. Totally dominant in this one. 13-0, the convincing final score. The Colorado Rockies jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Kyle Freeland earns the victory on the mound. Hyunjin Ryu was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. So that's a wrap for us in this one. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, Matt Vaskersian, we all thank you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. See you Three next hours time. And 45 minutes.